Algebra for Sports Fans Part 1, Making Connections Between Sports and Math Concepts. I'm Ken Boyd. I'm the owner of St. Louis Test Preparation. This is the first in our long series on using sports examples to explain algebra. You can see our email and our phone number below. The challenge for some math students. A certain percentage of students have difficulty learning algebra concepts. They become frustrated, they're convinced themselves they don't like math. You've heard people say, I'm not a math person. If the student doesn't absorb the algebra concepts, they cannot advance to upper level math classes like trigonometry, precalculus, on and on. Ultimately, they need to review algebra to be successful. They need algebra, for example, in the ACT exam. Here's a possible solution. Students succeed when they connect math concepts with topics they already know. Many students are sports fans. They play, watch, or follow sports. Sports can connect the student to math concepts. As a result, learning math is more interesting. They're learning really something about sports and not just math. They remember the math by recalling connections to sports. All their examples are sports related. So here's our first example evaluating an expression. And before we do that, we need to define the term variable. A variable is a letter used to represent one or more numbers. The numbers are the values of the equation. So an example below. 8y means 8 times y. The operation is multiplication times. 6 over b is 6 divided by b, which is division. So both y and b are variables. Here's an example that's a good one if you watch the Olympics. Hussam Bolt. Jamaica holds the current men's world record in the 100 meter dash. You may have seen it on TV in the 08 Beijing Olympics. His time was 9.69 seconds. Now converting it to yards, one meter is 100 and is 1.09 yards, so he ran 109 yards in 9.69 seconds. And most kids can picture that happening. Now Bolt's very tall, he's six foot five possibly the tallest world-class sprinter in history. He takes about 41 strides in a 100-meter race, or that is 109 yards. So a math question might be something with algebra. How long is each stride? Let x equal the length of each stride. Okay, we've got 109 divided by x equals the 41 strides that he took. If we solve for x by dividing both sides by 41, Moving left to right here, we find out that x is equal to 2.66 yards. So his stride is 2.7 yards. Long, long strides. Order of operation is another introductory concept in algebra. And we'll use one for t-shirt sales. First of all, what is order of operations? We use order of operations when we evaluate an expression and we learned what an expression was in the last slide, with more than one operation. By that we mean add, divide, multiply, etc. We use two operations, not just one. First, we perform any calculations inside the grouping symbols, the brackets. Then we perform multiplication division, moving left to right. And last, finally, we perform addition and subtraction. Here's an example of my t-shirts. Hank the Hoosier is selling t-shirts at the NCAA basketball tournament. He's a big Indiana fan. Half the t-shirts which say, Go Hoosiers, are purchased from a supplier at $5.95 each. The second half, which say Hoosiers rule, were bought for $6.15 each. So he knows what his cost is. The question at the bottom is, what is Hank the Hoosier's average cost for the t-shirts? After all, we say in parentheses. He needs to know his cost so he can price the t-shirts and make a profit. So order of operation. We created a formula where we add the prices of the two t-shirts together and divide by two. The result is at the bottom $2.10 the sum of the two t-shirt costs divided by two equals an average of $6.05. That's the end of part one of, of Algebra for Sports Fans. You can find part two on YouTube. 
If you need live tutoring in math, English, or the ACT exam, you'll see our website listed here, www.stltest.net, our email, and our phone number. You can also check our email for live online chats and live tutoring out of town. Thanks.